Hey guys, it's Ken Steep from McCann Professional Dog Trainers, and here we are again uh, at the Big Bucks Biathlon. It's uh, we're all pretty excited to uh, to get uh, the action started. A little bit of a chaotic morning trying to get all the live streaming stuff set up, and um, there's always so much to do at these events. So. It was a bit of a scramble and I apologize for showing up a couple of minutes late, but um, uh, it's a big day. We have, uh, um, there's going to be individual standard, team standard, or team standard, individual jumpers, team jumpers, um, as well as, I'm not, I'm not sure whether there's a, I don't think there's a team relay, but there's lots of events to, uh, to check out to today. Um, and I just want to welcome you guys back to McCann Dogs. Um, we'll go and uh, eavesdrop on uh, Kale's uh, briefing at uh, to to the um, all the competitors, and I'll just turn your turn the camera around here. I just want to welcome our friends at World Towning. Uh, we're excited that you could join us today on our live stream. Okay, what else do I need to tell you? Oh, 
we have a few people that are raising money for various uh, teams today. Uh, Linda has brought baking. So back there, so Linda Tabichi here. Raise your hand, Linda, so everybody can see. Um, she and Mochi have brought um, baking for you to, uh, to purchase. Um, Laura and Carrie and have a raffle and and Morgan. And Morgan, Morgan yes. The, well, and Morgan as well. Where's Morgan over there? Yes. Um, they have brought, and Denise, yes, um, have brought tickets for uh, Teeter Totter and Dog Walk to, to win. And then something else as well. Oh, I got different and stuff. And treats. Yeah. Oh, and treats. Yeah. Meat. 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 Just meat. Laura brought meat. Laura brought meat. <laughs> <laughs> So I could go in a lot of different ways. Where's me? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Denise, what do you have? I have a, a canine fitness. I have my dad's hockey book with Hockey Hall of Fame tickets. Oh, yeah. I have photo op with Amanda Woods and two jumps made by Don Hooper. Wow. Well, that's a lot. Woo. Okay. Wow. This is great. They're not here. They're in a the little bay. That's okay. That's okay. So anyways, we want to support our, our world teams for sure. It's, um, you know, it's, it's, yeah. everyone thinks it's like this huge amazing thing to go over to Worlds, and it is, but it is a crap ton of work to get there, uh, whether it's through training or fundraising or things like that, so any support that you could give would be obviously greatly appreciated. Uh, okay, without any further ado, if you have any <laughs> questions, let me know. If not, the course walk is now open. Don't forget you're on live stream, people. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so for anybody who, um, who doesn't know or isn't aware, a couple of our uh, viewers probably aren't totally sure what dog agility is, but um, what the, all of these handlers are going out and doing is, is they're walking the course. So this morning, when they arrived, they would have gotten a course map and um, they would have sort of planned their route, the way that they're going to run, it, run the course with their dog. And now's their opportunity to go around and check out whether they think the handling is going to work as well as to memorize the course. The dogs, of course, the dogs don't know where, uh, what the course is, so the handlers need to be uh, really great about um, showing their dog the course and giving them lots of information, especially uh, information early enough because the dogs are moving very, very quickly, so they need to make sure that their information is well-timed. Uh, and I'll just share, I'll turn the camera around and you guys can check that out, check out some of the course walk. I don't have the course map. Well, I do, but I, I don't have enough hands to read the course map uh, and uh, shoot with the camera. So uh, I, I unfortunately, I won't be able to walk you guys through the course, but you know, let's follow instructor Mark right here. We're gonna follow him through the course and see if we can get an idea of where it is. Now for you guys um, that are also on Camel Can Dogs uh, Facebook page, I'll see if I can post the actual course maps on there so that you can check them out and see what the courses are gonna be like. I believe we're starting. I think we're starting with uh, Team Jumpers, but I could be completely wrong. Here. If you guys could do me a favor, I'm sort of flying blind here. I don't really know what's coming out the other end. If you uh, can hear me okay and the stream's working okay, if you can just hit that thumbs up button. If, uh, if there are any audio or video issues, if you could just post it in the comments. I'm gonna break this stream up a little bit so that you guys can, uh, so that the, the um, competitors can find their runs more easily afterward. But, uh, oh great, I'm seeing a couple thumbs up. That's really great, thanks guys. Um, I'm going to uh, uh, break the stream up a little bit so that uh, competitors can find their runs more easily afterward. So after I um, shoot the opening, we'll go right into, uh, I'll have to use another camera and restart the feed. <coughs> so if this is your first time with us, make sure you hit that subscribe button so that you're notified when the live stream restarts and that's it. What do you think of the course, Mark? Love it, it's yeah? gonna be fast. Good, well that's exciting. Mark's got a really fast dog too, so it'll be exciting to watch him run. But if this is your first time with us, make sure you hit that subscribe button. You'll be notified when we go live again. Now I just posted a link on our Twitter at McCann Dogs. Uh, I think it's um, uh, always the live link, so if you're watching that link, anytime we go live, you'll be able to check it out. Yeah. It's kind of a rainy, drizzly, cold day, spring day here, uh, but luckily outside, but inside it's always amazing in here. It's always like the perfect temperature, nice and warm and dry. So it's really, really nice to have this opportunity out here in our, uh, in our agility arena. So I think what I'm going to do uh, is 
go set up the uh, the wide shot camera so that you guys can have a, a nice perspective of the course. I don't want to get caught uh, missing any of the um, competitors, especially the first couple competitors on the line. It, I really have to be careful where I'm going because I'm looking at the camera and there's lots of people moving around and I feel awful if I ran into someone. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go set up the wide shot um, so that you guys can get a, a good perspective of this and I'm going to go down to the little control area and then I will start the uh, live stream again so it will just be a couple of minutes but again if you're not subscribed to the channel hit that subscribe button so that you're notified when we go live again um, I'm also gonna try a couple little uh, a couple new things with the um, the output software so uh, I hope to be able to put titles and things on which course it is so that you guys can be more aware of what's going on but uh, on that note uh, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in a couple minutes bye for now